Welcome back to Sister Circle Live. Back to school is in full effect, and I'm sure your list looks like this. School supplies, check. Wardrobe, check. The only thing left is to check off that fresh face. Here to give us tips on how to achieve a natural makeup look for school and also how to take care of your skin is one of our amazing makeup artists, Kelvin Myers. Hi. 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 Good to have you on the show again. Good to be here. Yes, yeah, so let's talk about, you know, Instagram and full beat faces is a, is a thing, but how much is too much, Kelvin? Well, you know, that's, I, I want to say it's personal preference, but okay. we try to create a guideline. We yes. try to make some suggestions, and we want to start with the, the appropriate age groups for the appropriate look. Yes, good. And so we're going to start off with beautiful Madison, who is a middle schooler. Yes. So that is good. So we're talking about 13 to 15, to 15 mm -hmm. years old. And, you know, I have to tell Bailey, put some chapstick on. You know, <laughs> she's not into makeup just yet. But we do have some 13-year-olds that are into makeup. So let's see what we need to do to make sure they look appropriate at it. Absolutely. Okay. And so what we've done with Madison right here is this is the 13-year-old, 14-year-old look. Okay. And so we are really focusing here on mascara, lip balm, and blush. The skin looks amazing. Yes. She already has beautiful skin. We kind of groomed the brows just a little bit, mascara. And so when, you know, when you're moving to the next grade, mm -hmm. you know, you're still that preteen. Yes. But we want to add a little oomph. So we're going to do just like a graphic liner. Okay. Okay, making it real simple. Wow. Close. And how easy or hard is it to teach a young girl like Madison and Bailey how to kind of do their own makeup and still be in mama's good graces? Well, here's the deal. That's why we want to give a good guideline mm -hmm. so we, we can give you just like a tutorial mm -hmm. real quick mm -hmm. and you see what it is. Mom knows what it is. She knows what it is. Right. And they have these beautiful organizers that you can just put all of your makeup in. Okay. Yes, and it keeps it very, very simple. So as we get a little older, you can put a little, little something on the top. Now, what exactly does that do for a look? What this does right here is it defines the eye, okay. brings the attention to the eye, makes it pop. She has on a lip balm. We don't want to do too much. We want her to look age appropriate. Okay. Okay, so okay. she looks great here. That's just a graphic liner right there from uh, Sephora that I picked up. Okay. Real easy. Goes with almost any complexion and anything that she would be wearing. Okay. What about, the, what about this lip, though? Now, with the lip, so look, as we, you know, grow up, <laughs> we can get a little more color. Okay. But right now, I think that this works very well very for nice. her. This very nice. This is very nice. This is what real nude is. Nude is supposed to mimic your own mm -hmm. lip color. Yes. Okay. And how we know the amount is right, especially for this age group? Well, when it's nude, you really can't go wrong. Okay. As long as it doesn't have a whole bunch of color mm -hmm. that's going to be like really standing out, she'll be fine. Okay. Sounds okay. good. So now we are going over to high school. Now we can get a little, we can get a little sassy with high school. Now we get a little a bit little sassier bit. with okay, high school. But what I good. really want to stress, Rashawn, is always taking care of the skin, no matter what, from this group to this group. Yes. She is a senior. This is Isley. Hey, Isley. She's 17. Yes. And what we really want to make sure is we're doing that three-step basic process. Okay. Wash, tone, moisturize every morning. It doesn't matter. Now, if you have some other extenuating circumstances, you know you can go to a skincare specialist. Yes. For that. So you but say wash, tone, moisturize. So I need to get a toner for Bailey. Absolutely. Okay, you should so be I toning. A, okay, all right. Toning brings the skin back into balance, the correct pH balance, so it can receive the moisture and it can gotcha. penetrate the skin. Okay, all Absolutely. right. Absolutely. So we're in high school now, so we got a little, little bit more. Yes. Yeah, what so did we do differently? What you see here is we did a little bit of a tinted balm, tinted moisturizer, we did concealer, and eyeliner. Okay. So eyeliner is really important because, again, instead of doing a graphic liner, we did a regular black eyeliner, mm -hmm. and we filled the brows in, and we have a little bit of the shimmer on the lips. Right. right? So, but we're going to also do just a bit of bronzer so we are moving up just a little just bit in the a world. Little bit. Yes. And so what does the bronzer do around that area? What it does is it warms up the hairline because here's what what happens. We're typically a little bit darker on the outside of the face okay. and lighter on the inside. So the face needs to stay three-dimensional. Yes. So this just warms it up and it just gives a real nice pretty healthy glow. Right. So what's the type of conversations we, be, we should be having with our daughters, uh, in your opinion, about makeup and like introducing them to it? What would you say? Well, first of all, letting them know that this is an accent and a compliment Got to it. them, not it doesn't make who they are. Okay, good. Okay, okay. and okay. what we want to know is we want makeup to be an accessory, mm -hmm. just like their clothes, a bracelet, a pair of shoes, or a purse. All right, okay? sounds good. Uh-oh, we're on to college. We're on to college. We're on to college. Yay. Hey, college girl. 
<laughs> Good. All right. What so are we doing? So this is my friend Casey. Hey, and Casey. Casey is looking very lovely and beautiful as a college girl. So you know when you're going off to college, there's some things that you might need to be getting ready for. Mm -hmm. You know, it may be an interview, maybe you have a presentation. So right. you just want to pump it up a bit. Yes. So we did here just a very medium uh, coverage foundation. Mm -hmm. She has beautiful skin already, but we wanted to make it look very polished and even. Then we added lashes. See? So see how we graduate yes. we from the mascara, light coat, double coat. Then now we're actually doing a light uh, actual light lash. Nice. Okay. And we're going to add shimmer highlighter. Okay. Okay. So we know that that's really popular and modern right now. So again, we want to really focus on those basic steps. Okay. That's good so stuff. So this is by Anastasia and we're just going to take it here starting at the very top of the cheekbone, bringing it down. And notice I'm using a fan brush uh -huh. and just really swirling it. Right. It's very soft, very easy. How do you recommend like, like that startup kit for folks who are just getting into makeup? Is there such a thing or just try to take it, take it low? So you don't want the most expensive brushes, but you want the job to be well, done. Here's what I suggest. I suggest going to like a Target or either mm -hmm. a CVS and getting some brushes. So, you know, you want this is your practice time. Yes. You want to get good. So you don't want to spend too much on the brushes and on the makeup, even right now, you can kind of stick with a mass marketing uh, place like CVS yes. or Ulta where you can get those cosmetics that are a little bit less expensive. Okay, good, yes. good. So I got to give a shout out to South Decat Mall because when I did start wearing makeup, I used Bavanti, the kiosk, little red Bavanti. Still do though. Yes. That was my only thing, little red. Listen, a little red <laughs> goes a long way. Yes, it does. But we want to graduate into red uh, after high school and college. <laughs> right. Yes. Awesome. Well, these ladies look absolutely beautiful. Thank you so much. This was very well done. And now we are equipped with all the tools that we need to make sure our girls are wearing the right amount of makeup. And this was executed very well. Make sure you follow him at I am Kelvin Myers on all social media platforms. Give it up for our lovely ladies and Kelvin Myers. Right.